And tonight's Health Watch, could artificial intelligence help doctors diagnose rare diseases by looking at your face? It's a whole different use of facial recognition technology. Dr. Max Goma is here to show us how this is proving to be a very sharp medical assistant. Doctor. Yeah, that's right. And when you see, when you hear of facial recognition, you probably think crime fighting or maybe homeland security screening for terrorists. Turns out a person's face can tell us a lot about their genetic makeup and the medical conditions it may cause. A computer can learn to read those differences. There are hundreds and again, even thousands of diseases that manifest with very unique uh, facial appearances. As Deco Gelbman, the CEO of artificial intelligence company FDNA, told me today, the key word there is rare. Even an experienced doctor may not see many cases of some of these genetic disorders. But a much more sophisticated version of security facial recognition can look at many thousands of faces, and the computer can use machine learning to recognize the subtle differences in genetic disorder faces. FDNA calls their system Deep Gestalt. A form of artificial intelligence that goes through a large data set of images and learns how to classify very specific patterns uniquely associated with specific genetic disorders. That's what FDNA has now proven with a groundbreaking study in the journal Nature Medicine. Deep Gestalt examined 17,000 facial images of patients diagnosed with over 200 genetic syndromes and correctly came up with a list of possible diagnoses 91% of the time. But this is not meant to replace a doctor's diagnosis. It presents a list of potential candidate diseases as an add-on to genetic testing. That's important because genetic testing is still time-consuming and expensive. Deep Gestalt can narrow the possibility significantly, especially for doctors who may not see many of these rare conditions. Now, this facial recognition is just the beginning. FDNA says they're working on feeding the computer videos of patients' movements, their speech tone and patterns, as well as clinical notes and medical scans, and integrate that with genetic information to achieve even more accurate diagnoses. It's uh, a brave new world. It really is. I just got the new phone where you, you know, you see. Oh, to unlock it. Right, right, right. And I'm like blown away by that. Even no. when I put on my glasses, it'll still recognize me. Oh my gosh. Not with Fascinating. It's so. scary. And we don't recognize you. <laughs> that's a whole other thing. Okay. Very Thank cool. You, Thank you.